What is up everybody, my name is Hutz and welcome to God's Trigger. Before we begin, I'd like to announce that this video is sponsored by Techland. So thank you Techland for taking an interest in my channel. Also at any time, you guys can click the link in the description to go directly to the Steam page where you can check out God's Trigger yourself. This game will be available on PC, PS4, and Xbox April 18th. All right, let's get to it. Welcome everybody to God's Trigger. Let's jump right into this thing, shall we? So God's Trigger is a single player or couch co-op top-down shooter. It's a lot like Hotline Miami, if you guys are familiar with that game. It seems very flushed out and it follows two individuals as single player. You can switch between the two, an angel and a demon. So essentially in this game, we're gonna have to try to figure out how to kill everybody without getting killed ourselves. You guys will see. An angel and a demon, fighting side by side. How did it come to this? It's no time for second guessing. Right now the fate of the world depends on us killing our way into heaven. I almost feel like you could tell if a game's gonna be good just based on the art style. I'm gonna be using controller for this, you guys. But you can use keyboard and mouse if that's what you prefer. Left trigger to perform melee attacks. I'm about to die. Booyah! Bra this is in slow-mo right now. Triple kill. All right, Escape from Purgatory is our first mission. It's gonna kinda put us through the tutorial here. We are starting off as the angel. Let's do this thing. Where are we going? Who wants some of this? So if I just rush in there and uh, trigger them, I can press Y, by the way, for a stealth kill. Uh, you, you die, one hit, that's all you get. So you really have to be careful about how you go, uh, how you go about doing all this stuff. You gotta kind of plan your attacks. So I want to get it in there when the guy's backs turn, maybe stealth kill both of them. Check that out. If I open a door, it'll stun them, I do believe. And I'll get an extra chance to do some damage, yeah, see? And then I can actually execute them on the ground. Pretty brutal. I also get a dash move like this. I can charge through walls with it. Cool. Oh, yeah. You gotta, you gotta get the timing down. All right, now we get a chance to switch to the other character. Judy the Demon, she gets uh, a teleport ability. Beyblade mode activated. All right, so now the option, if I press uh, B on my controller, I switch between the angel and the demon. This guy can charge to the wall, the angel can, or the demon can go through the bars. So I just went like, bruh, like that. Oh man, I'm too good. Enemies are knocked down by opening doors. Yeah, we already went through that. Open the door, charge to the one guy right there, and then uh, uh, kill him quick. Check it out. Bruh. Oh yeah, execute. For your, sins. For your sins. Power slide. RB to dash and teleport. Gotta fly. All right, guns now. Press right trigger to shoot. So left trigger to melee, right trigger to shoot. Gotcha. Do I want to shoot him? Got him. What is this? Special abilities. Okay, so if we get enough cool kills, we'll charge our meter in the bottom left. And we can use our left stick to uh, activate our special ability, the, the angel. Harry, his ability is to go invisible for a second. So we can sneak by people, get behind them. Sounds incredibly nice. Judy's ability, mind control. Oh my. Wow, okay. So I took over that one guy, but he wasn't very successful. I probably should have held it down and I could have selected who to give it to. That's my bad. Can use right stick to mark targets. Let's mark him as one and him as two and we'll automatically fire on them when we're in range. Pop, pop, just like that. Killing one enemy gives you one energy charge. Stealth kills give you two. Uh oh, that's a lot of people. What does this button do? Shocks, I figured it out. All right, so I want to alert them and then press that button. Gotta go. Wow, that was close. Stairway to heaven, we've made it. It's a trap. No, 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 you can't start a story at the end. Where's the mystery? All right, so because I used Harry more than Judy, he leveled up more. And because he leveled up, I get to uh, unlock new stuff. Let's see what that looks like. Maybe after a cutscene. Falling gave me some time to think. And I gotta tell you, 
Nobody deserves the apocalypse before it's due. Not even humans. If I were to get my payback, first I had to stop the four horsemen. Luckily, an unexpected help was on its way to lead me straight to them. I had to take down the horsemen, one at a time. So it's something about Harry being kicked out of heaven and then having to kill the four horsemen of the apocalypse to get back in? All right, you guys, there's 14 upgradable and customizable abilities and also eight special perks for each character. Right now we are upgrading Judy's melee weapon. Do we want more speed, more range, or more bonus XP per kill? Um, Speed sounds really nice. And we can also upgrade her teleport ability. Uh, faster cooldown or more stun range. So like, I think when she teleports to an area, she stuns everybody. Let's do stun range. And minus energy cost for her mind control? Sure. On to Harry. Bonus XP, bonus XP, bruh. Without wings? Watch your tongue. We'll exchange pleasantries later. All right, next mission. Let's go. I don't know what I'm doing. Gotta, gotta fly, don't get shot. Oh, he shot me. So this is where we have to like really plan out how we're gonna go about doing this. That's a double kill. Oh, dodge. Damn it! Get the gun guys first, man. Ah! Not, well, not, yeah, not that. Got him. Can we break shit? Break the TVs, that's our mission. Oh, hey, there's a gun on the ground. <laughs> Let's probably take those, eh? And some more ammo here. Free stuff if we break. I, I just got ammo from a chair. Sure, dude. Got him. Got him. Got him. Stupid TV. All right. Um, let's see here. Is a gun guy? What does the guy at the arcade have? Anything special? I missed. I fired. I missed. What if I charge at him? What happens if I use my special ability? What happens if I change characters? How about that, huh? Oh. Jeez, I need more range on that. I need more range on that. Got him. I'm obviously like new to these top-down shooters. But you play Isaac! Not the same. All right, let's get a stealth kill off. Actually, you know what? Let's use our special, well, maybe not yet. Oh, oh, I tried to get a double stealth, didn't work. Let's see here. Should we use our thing in here? I don't know if that guy's got a gun or left. I would want it to uh, uh, mind control a gun guy. He does have a gun. Let's take it, control of this guy. Okay, now what? You're supposed to help me, man! Then they're, they're, none of them are in range. Boss time, maybe let's use it now. Can we use it on the boss? I can. He's not in range though of anything. And I'm dead. Bruh. Got him, he's a, he's a two hitter. Grab a shotgun, that sounds sweet. Bruh. The four horsemen send their regards. Run, demon. Ah, oh, jeez. Gotta escape. Gotta go faster. So, we got a lot to work on, obviously. 10 deaths, not very good. I bet this game would be like super fun too as a couch co op. Here we are. Next mission. We look for cool stuff. More energy, sweet. All right, this is gonna be a dash. Got him. I like the idea of finding cool stuff in the in the environment. 1,000 XP, sweet. All right, what do we got coming up? Treasure chest. It's in here. Find your first perk, sweet. All right, two guys. Ah! Oh, I can't just execute him when the other guy's alive. I go like this. Bruh. Then go back. I like how there's tons of checkpoints, so it like really doesn't uh, punish you for trying out new techniques. Let's see if I can mark all these guys. <laughs> what? Oh my goodness. That used up like all of my energy, but I'm getting tons of energy just from the environment. Uh, shotgun guy. Uh, what if we switch to her? She doesn't have her ability ready yet, though. Ooh. Oh, no. Oh, no. Got him. Got him. Oh, he's still alive! <laughs> I had no idea. 
Come around the back. Oh my god. Wow, sharpshooter. All right, let's 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 mark a couple people here. I got two. He did. He did. Oh my god, two and one. Did you see that? I got an achievement for that. All right. Oh, yes, I know exactly what I'm going to do here. Let's take over the shotgun guy. Woohoo! Oh, that's right. We can uh, teleport to get secret stuff. What is this? Collectible mate. Hang on a second. I gotta go to the bathroom quick. Who wants to feel the shotgun? Surprise! Wow. Oh, hey! More shotgun guy! Ah! Oh! Easy. Can I attack when I'm invisible? Probably not. Maybe I want to use her energy up then again, because that was sweet. Kind of like this. Yeah. I like the range on her melee. That is handy. Oh god, I should have saved it for this spot. Oh, hey, hey, chest. What is it? 5,000 XP. Release trapped souls. Okay. Energy, please. Can I get some energy? Free energy? Anyone? There we go. Got a little bit. If I could just like pop in real quick and get a stealth kill, but I don't think I'll be able to. Son of a. This looks like a dash throughable wall, doesn't it? Maybe even teleport through. Oh! Um, okay. It seems like everything's randomized every single time that you uh, start over. Because now I got enough energy. I didn't even do anything different. Definitely this guy. Well, maybe the... Uh, no, this is a good guy. Oh, man. Now what? Bruh! Oh. I uh, hear you're looking for me. Is that pestilence? Both people uh, leveled up. Sweet. A C! Just used my first perk. I put it on Judy. It extends the combo multiplier time, which sounds really good for racking up points. Upper uh, chain range. And the cooldown of Harry's dash. Find the real Lance Pesting. Pesting? Is that pestilence? Is Really bad nickname. Dynamite. Yeah. I'll test that. Right, maybe like right in here. Uh, well I did throw it. How do I use that then without like alerting everybody? Nope. 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 No. 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 Oh, there's a map right there too on the other side. I'd like to get to that. Boink. Oh, that's a dynamite. Wow. Okay. Ammo crate. What is this? Oh, look at that. Blunderbuss. We take her for a spin. Pretty good. Woo -hoo -hoo. Oh, the guy behind me. I didn't even see him there. Gotta be smarter. Gotta be smarter. Boom, baby. How do we get back to that one map? Through here, yes. Oh, it's another one. It's page two. Oh, Jesus. Uh, wow. Oh, yeah. Wow. Okay. Surprise. What you got for me? What is this thing? I don't know what this is. Take her for a spin. Mark them. Wow. What was even happening, man? <laughs> oh, poison bomb. Also this, can I throw this to the wall? I can, okay, you can throw that over walls. That's good to know. That's really good to know. Oh, shotgun guy. Shotgun guy, no more. Hey! Knock it off. Nothing but melee, watch this. <laughs> Pretty sizable map here, so like, ah! Uh, seems like he really gotta actually explore the map to find the secrets and to, to complete it, which is, that's a good thing. Where are we at here? This looks like it's boss time, doesn't it? Get him, boys. I guess that one's real. Uh-oh. Got it. Easy mode, bruh. All right, gotta chase after him. Level complete. How many deaths? 500? I really did use Harry like a little bit too much there, I think. Oh yeah, 22 deaths. Just give me my C. 
Hey. All right, you guys, it seems like a good time for me to stop. Don't forget the link in the description, you guys, to go to the Steam page to check this game out for yourself. Comes out April 18th on PC, PS4, and Xbox. Once again, thank you, Techland, for sponsoring this video. Let me know you guys' thoughts in the comments section down below. And as always, I will see you in the next video. See you guys.